Hey everybody, welcome back to Fernandez Tool Reviews. Uh, I wanted to share with you this uh, foam, toolbox foam or tool foam that I got off of Amazon. Uh, it's by On Riva, I believe that's how you say it. Uh, I got a three pack for $30 of these one inch two tone foams. They're, uh, I think, uh, 18 inches by 12 and then one inch deep. I've already made a couple organizer trays with them. Um, what I did was I, for the second one, I used this uh, cardboard template that I made out of uh, just some trash cardboard and then traced it around a slim organizer of the Milwaukee Packouts, and that made the uh, cuts a lot better on the second one. I also traced the first ones with a um, Sharpie and then cut it. That wasn't, didn't go as well as the second one. Uh, these aren't mounted in, but um, I still have space here to decide what I want to put in there because these are just the main things that I already carried and I didn't want to necessarily just keep adding stuff because I had the space but um, for now this area right here is uncut um, so yeah these didn't go this one I did without a template I just held the foam up there kind of cut it to size there was uh, less waste definitely after I made the template but uh, I messed up in a few areas and overcut or just tore. Um, I was able to go back through and throw in some extra pieces of scrap right here to like patch up some stuff with a little glue. That definitely cleans it up just a little bit. I mean, you can tell just the cleanliness of the edges and depths and stuff on the second one I did first the first one. Um, there's a little more, more gas. I mean, this socket is a, a different one from the original set of Mac uh, 3 8 impact sockets. Um, I lost the 18 and haven't got the Mac one back or just ordered a one. But I did cut this foam to the same kind of height or depth. That's why this uh, there's a little bit more space there. And uh, Anyway, the... Uh, you can see some of the Sharpie markings of the old uh, when I did the cuts. And you can see the uh, second tone. See, if it's easy to tell if something's missing later on, but it uh, holds it pretty well. I mean, the quality of the foam is is nice. Um, these foams can be pretty ridiculous in price, especially if you get them like pre cut, uh, the Kaizen foam, and all that stuff. But it, it definitely makes your tools look nice and um, help you stay organized and know where everything's at if you're into that type of stuff so uh, with the template I did uh, I made the foam go a little bit further in to the slim pack outs and then um, on this side I didn't use a sharpie I just placed the tool down where I got my layout first I kind of set things on top where I thought I was going to want them make some changes later on but then I just use the exacto uh the equivalent kind of just box cutter thing that I had um available and use the blade to actually trace around the tool made just like a shallow cut and then went back through and cut to the depth that I thought I was going to need these quarter inch ones um extensions and stuff I didn't go as deep just so it would hold and I didn't have to like really dig in there. I mean, you can't see the other secondary layer, like the red color, but um, it's okay. It's still, you can still tell the difference um, in, the, in the color of the foams. I mean, obviously if you have something missing, but uh, these are just kind of placed in. Some of them are um, over an inch tall. So I just did them uh, vertically and they just sit down in there but uh yeah this was uh, a lot better fitment than the first one um, just something to try and uh i mean once you 
have the template made out of uh, cardboard or whatever, then you can just, if you have multiple organizers that you want to do the same thing to, um, you can just use that. But uh, the uh, template for the slim organizers that I made kind of works for the deeper organizers, like the two inch or however tall they are. But uh, there's small differences towards the front of the tray, which I mean, you can kind of ad lib that, however. Um, but yeah, this is uh, really nice. I like it a lot. And I mean, $30 for three um, sheets of that is uh, not bad um, compared to some of the other stuff. Yeah, you have to pre cut, you have to cut it yourself and all that. But I don't mind that little extra work. It's it's a nice little hobby um, type thing for me. Uh, yeah, just let me know what you think. And I think that uh, if you have an interest in cleaning up your tools like this, um, you should definitely check out that uh, this company off of Amazon or on Amazon. But, uh, yep, thanks for watching. Let me know what you think. Have a good day.